All right, cool. So what I have here is something very cool. It's a Sharp RD680AV tape player. And yeah, it's a, I was told it was one of those machines that uh, you would probably use in an interrogation room or something like that. It's, um, yeah, <laughs> this thing is pretty cool. Um, there's your basic condenser mic you can use. I'm like here. You got a line in, you got a speaker, HP out, and then a line out. And uh, yeah, I bought it for 20 bucks. These things can go for like around 70, 80, maybe 90 on eBay. And I think that's in the worst condition. This thing is barely, like it's been barely used. So here's a bunch of cassettes I'm gonna just put in here. And uh, yeah, but this thing is pretty cool. So I'll take a random cassette, and I've, all these cassettes you see here I got out of the free bin. Um, indicator, and this has a built-in speaker. Right there on the back somewhere. There it is. So yeah, we got automatic level cording. And then this PA monitor, which the thing is where you can monitor your recordings if um, if memory serves me right, but it's your tone and your volume. Well, let's hit play, shall we? This thing is pretty sweet. Now, the only thing it doesn't have is battery compartment, so you really can't make it portable. Though it looks like it could. I mean, you can take it places, because it's it looks like a suitcase when you have it closed. Oh, it's got all maxed stop. Cool. So yeah, pretty sweet. Meter here. Got a meter there so that you can monitor your recordings and I'm gonna actually try and record right now. This thing have a tab in it. Oh it does. Good. <clears throat> I'm gonna test with the built-in condenser mic, so let's take a look at how this is. Uh Okay, yep, I saw the needle move. All right, so this is a test to see how well the condenser mic on this sharp um, tape player actually plays. And uh, I'm not sure if volume control aids in it. Nope, doesn't look like it does. Okay, so, um, yep. can't tell if it's actually recording sound, but... I don't know, I guess I'll find out. I don't hear anything. So I can barely hear myself, so I'm not sure how well the, the condenser mic doesn't seem to be working too well. So, <clears throat> but, um, <clears throat> excuse me, Jesus Christ. I don't have a, one of those sockets that's big enough for the uh, holes to try line in recording with music. So, oh, it even has a remote slot here too, huh, that's cool. But you know what? That's okay, because it still plays 
my tapes, and that's all I really care for, really. So. Don't even know what the hell's on this tape, but. The tape kind of works, so that's good. Oh, this is right there. It says something of the pigs. Oh, that's nice. I don't know it. March. It looks like it says March of the pigs. Huh. Interesting. Don't know ya. Oh, look at it. Blank. Score. All right, so yeah, gonna enjoy this. I really can't show the heads because of the angle, but looks relatively clean in there. Like it's barely used, like I said. So, awesome. And then you just take the thing and close it, but the cord's in the way right now, so. But yep, that is the Sharp Tape Player Model RD680. AV. Alright, later.